Hey everyone, in this video we are going to be looking at an example of circular motion. Uh, in particular, we're going to be solving for centripetal acceleration. Let's highlight the key information. A car is driving around a turn. So there's our, our circular motion that has a radius of 160 meters and it's driving at a velocity of 110 kilometers per hour. We have been asked to solve the centripetal acceleration experienced by the driver. So this is that acceleration that pushes you outward, you know, like against the side of the door. And that's the feeling that we're looking for here. So we're trying to figure out what that acceleration is. The equation that we're going to be using is A is equal to V squared over R. This is our centripetal acceleration equation where V is the velocity and R is the radius of the turn. Our velocity does have to be in meters per second, so we're going to have to convert that kilometers per hour into meters per second. To do that, we divide by 3.6. 110 divided by 3.6 gives us 30 decimal 56 meters per second. Great! Now we have our velocity in the correct units. Let's go ahead, set this into the equation. Our acceleration will equal the 30.56 that's the velocity that we solved for we know that squared don't forget that part all divided by the radius of the turn that's 160 meters we can plug this right into our calculator no tricks what it's going to equal is a is 5.84 meters per second squared about half the force of earth's gravity so yeah you're gonna feel a little bit of push over to the side of the door maybe you're white knuckled hanging onto that seat and probably should slow down around this turn Hopefully this was helpful. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below, and I'll be looking forward to seeing you next time.